Hey, this short video is going to go over three different ways that you're able to use the Minimax in order to backward bend over it, which is going to help you open up your chest and improve your mid-back mobility into backward bending improving your posture. So what I have here is the mini mat with a rounded end towards me. Uh, and then I can just go ahead and lie back and allow my head to be on the mini max and so are my upper back and shoulders. And then I can reach one arm overhead, allowing that reach to help me feel a slight stretch into backward bend. I can then choose to send both arms back so that weight is going to be pulling back. I could also choose to add a small weight in either of my hands. Option to circle those arms gently down. I can also work into the reclining Buddha position from yoga, where I can have my arms down at my side, feeling the support of the mini max in the backward bend position. And then from there, I could also support my head if that felt better for me. And if I wanted to do further backward bending, I could go ahead and push myself back and allow that more intense backward bend to occur. Uh, and then if you wished, you can go ahead and open up those legs, inhaling deeply into your belly exhaling the tension and allowing the release backwards with support. So the mini max is soft but still supportive, allowing you to find that stretch and to stay in that stretch in order to increase the length of your muscle spindles. And from there we'll go ahead and bring those legs upright and then come on out. So there's also the option to turn the Minimax towards you in the sense that we'll go over the slope. This tends to be a little less intense to do it in this way. Um, but once again, you just get to that backward bend position where your head is up on top and then adding the reach overhead to start to open up the shoulders and the chest and to encourage that sense of backward bending. Just as before, you could also option to have the arms overhead and then circle down. You can also just choose to have those arms overhead, perhaps also opening those legs. You could have those arms in a T position. There's also the option to have your back up on the slope. So now my bottom is not on the mat and I can just go ahead and backward bend along the weight of my elbows and the weight of my head to pull me back. Option to open up those knees, playing around with possibly sending my back further over the slope or instead coming down. But always trying to listen to your body and giving the body the stretch that you need, not forcing, but welcoming. Because in our modern day, we do so much texting and computer work that we have more of a hunched posture. So very important to open up. So the third way to use the mini max is to have it flipped with the rounded end towards us. And then we're gonna use the rocking action to start to come back. So I'm gonna have my bottom on the very base of the mini max and then I can start to rock back. Supporting your head, allowing one leg to lengthen, seeing how that feels, allowing the other leg to lengthen. So here the weight of the legs is lower than the mini max, so that's gonna to start to increase some stretch. I can go ahead and release one arm to straight, still supporting my head with the other arm. I can bring that arm back and then release the other. If this is feeling very comfortable, then going ahead and allowing the backward bend to occur, possibly rocking so the head does touch. Or if that's not feeling good, maybe just bending one knee, maybe supporting with the opposite arm or supporting with the same side arm and reaching back. 
So hopefully this short video has shown you that there's a lot of different ways that you can use your mini max in order to backward bend, improving your posture by having the ability to stand up a little bit straighter and getting away from being so hunched forward. It also feels really good to open up the mid back because we often get so tight in that area for women, it's at that bra line. Please reach out with any questions. Thanks so much.